Okay, now ladies, now let's get information. Prove to me you got some cooperation. I'm not a poet, I'm a truth teller. And I don't need no snaps with this. I want you to hear me loud and clear. I'm singing a cappella. If I could talk to my 10-year-old self, I would tell her not to be jealous or envy. The little black girl with curly hair who got straight A's in class sitting right next to me. I would tell her, then rather than pointlessly making every other girl into enemies, it is much better to form a friend. And instead of feeling inadequate like I was the class dummy, I would invite that same little girl over after school and ask her if she would teach me how to study see we would have a fun sleepover and eat chocolate cake and sip on milkshakes we would let our 10 year old dreams and ideas unfurl we would jump on the bed watch destiny's child videos and scream out girls rule the world iron sharpens iron so one man sharpens another when we realize two heads are better than one we'll stop competing with each other we're here for creation let's get information the true images of sisterhood need to be reshaped like like imagine if nikki and kim both came together to put out a mixtape the Bible says two are better than one because there's good reward for her labor. So when your sister falls, you would be the one there to save her. But woe to her who falls when she's alone and has not another to pick her up or lift her up. When we hold each other accountable, we leave no room for jealousy or hate to interrupt. Women, we are inventors, creators, and debaters. Together, we are unstoppable. The perfect definition of powerful. The perfect synonym of bountiful, plentiful, fruitful, giving, and big-hearted. So let's link up with our sisters and help each other get our idea started let's put in the groundwork and build up our networks like imagine if oprah and kathy hughes both came together to create that network if I could turn back the hands of time and jump back a decade, I would tell my younger self that she was beautifully and wonderfully made. I would take all of the lack of knowledge and love for self out of her heart. Tell her that God made her special, gave her gifts and talents that set her apart. I would tell her to build a foundation and get in formation with all the other little girls who wanted to do big things and had big dreams. I would tell them that together they were valuable, they were adequate, they were worthy, they were good enough, they were smart enough, they were strong enough, they were fearless, they were leaders I would put all of their insecurities on a piece of paper burn them and set them free I would tell them that the girl that they strive to grow up to be well she she is we okay now ladies now let's get information prove to me you got some cooperation